Gator Engine Build Part 1. What is up my machines? I hope you guys are enjoying your day. I hope you're feeling froggy fresh. I hope life is moving like a well-oiled machine. And if it's not, well tune in. Let's have a little bit of fun today, shall we? Like I said, if you're not feeling the greatest today, let this upload take you out of the world Put a smile on your face. Give you an incentive to make the day a little better. Today we are cleaning out the garage. We're we're cleaning it all up. I'm not. I don't like the dust right now. It's really really dusty, and every time I kneel down, my pants get dirty. No, I'm not afraid of dirt. I just don't like it because it's an inefficiency. It's it's in the way. So that means if we have a cleaner workspace, that's less tool cleaning. That's less apparel cleaning. And it's just an all around good thing. Uh, I cleaned up a lot of this. I got the refrigerator out, the wood out. Still remember when you hit that bad point, came up and some boards for her. Oh yeah. <laughs> Good job, gun. <laughs> the warehouse, picked up some paint, went part shopping, did a whole bunch of shopping. The Duramax is tuneless, so it's smoking a lot more. However, it's not as fast as it was last night. 2017's fall in New York is excellent. Like, we don't even have to wear our sweatshirts right now. It's, it's super hot. Usually, around this time of the year, you're bundled up in like a jacket, and it's snowing, and now it's like beautiful weather. And luckily, that's making the floor dry a lot quicker. Everybody knows how much I like to paint. I painted the Duramax, I painted what else did I paint? I also painted the flag, now we're painting the floor. We got all sorts of good stuff. We got paint, we got rollers, we're gonna get our roll on. We're gonna be rolling dirty. Actually, thanks to the pressure washer, we'll be rolling clean. Paint problems, you always have paint problems. I ha always have paint problems. We, uh, well, Kyle, he checked out the paint. What, what's the paint got to say there, Kyle? It's gotta dry for a while. It's, he says it's gonna take a whole day just for like feet to walk on it. And then for vehicles, it's five days, and then probably heavier vehicles like the Duramax is probably actually longer. It probably is going to take like six or seven days, so that kind of sucks. But it's three times the strength. When you're, when you're talking about strength, it, it's not surprising that it's going to take longer. I hate paint. It's official, I hate paint. This was a pain, the Duramax was a pain, the floor is going to be a pain, I'm officially over with paint. It will look really good though. I mean, just cleaning it with the pressure washer did a lot. Here's the most important piece. This is the crankshaft. Uh, this clutch, you guys know, it didn't fit originally on this crankshaft. And uh, let's just say I found a supplier and a very nice guy to lay this down. So now, fits. eBay, nothing but the best. This sucker brand new. It looks like it, doesn't it? The rod on the last one was actually seized to the crankshaft. Not really bad, like the crankshaft is in still really good shape, so we don't have to replace that. And if we had to replace that, the, this engine would probably be shot. So instead of just buying the rod, I got the rod, the piston, and the rings all as one thing, because the other piston on the other rod actually needed these same parts. So basically I got every single thing I needed right here for one low price. I like low prices. I don't even trust that. You don't drink. trust that? No. That's, that's 100 inch pounds. That's I mean, really, put, that's put the, the torque portion, spec. There's nothing there. I think a new one was 140 and then the used one was 100. So I'm like, okay, we'll go with 100. Maybe we should go right in the middle at 120. Cause I mean that, I, I agree with you. Let's go 120, let's go buck 20. We're trying to justify our own torque spec. <laughs> buck 20? Yeah, yeah, this time. Oh uh, yeah, for sure. 
<laughs> Got her? Okay, we're at a buck 20. That's what she calls for. How the heck did this get in there? That's not a small piece. It's supposed to be in there. Tighten the rims like this. I mean, you have both had tires fall off or tracks. You've had a rim fall? Yeah, back one. When? Uh, maybe a month or two after you did. Nah. -uh. I fell off on the road. Really? Mm hmm. Really? Rear driver. That might be a problem that they did. Kyle said that his tire on his Duramax fell off the exact same one that fell off of mine the rear driver wheel. I was like, why are all my other ones really tight, but this one fell off? It fell the f off. Like, it fell off. I, mean, I, I can't remember if it was 3 o'clock or 4 o'clock in the morning. I just punched it out of work going down the road, about right in front of my house, falls off. Oh my goodness. It was kind of neat. I was just driving down the road and she tires. No, it's not. Well, let me tell you this it's not kind of neat when you're going like 90 miles an hour. <laughs> Alright, turn the crank over. Hey, you oh, real easy. That's how it's supposed to be, baby. Oof. Wow, that's nice. Oof. Dude, this thing's gonna have a supercharger. You got a supercharger? Oh, yeah. It's in the, the mail. I turned away into for it. Is it really? Yeah. It's in the mail. When did you get that? Oh. Hey, don't worry about it. We can't let the competition know all our secrets. Head is 15 foot pounds. Kyle showed up in his machine merch, but it was too hot, so he, he doesn't have a t-shirt. Sorry, buddy, I don't have a t-shirt on me, otherwise I'd hook you up. These are comfy. These are comfy, and, and you would look better working on that thing, but I'm sorry, I don't have anything on me. Just to remind you guys, you guys have got about 24 hours of the 72-hour sale. Like I said, if you buy a shirt, a sweatshirt, any of the machine decals that you see here, also here I'll show you the ones in my truck that you can buy too. This decal or that decal, or a machine hitch step, I will send you a pair of these mirror decals. What's the first thing that you do when you look at my mirrors now? You laugh. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's right, you laugh. So the those decals actually aren't on the website. I'll just throw them in your order, and they look just like this. If you want an easy excuse to put a smile on your face every day, throw those things on your mirrors. You laugh every time. How's she looking, buddy? She's perfect. Dialed in. Perfect, yeah. Dialed right in. Sounds like the next door neighbor's rocking out. Yeah. At least there's no insulation between the walls so you can hear the music good. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's really nice. Okay, you know what really stokes me up? Oof, I don't even need gas. We'll just... You don't even need gas, buddy. At this point, we may as well just make it a diesel. I don't always cross-thread things, but when I do, got I, recorder. I send it home with an impact. So Kyle just left. Look at the floor, it's still damp, and it's a really, really warm day today. We had, we had the door up to kind of give it some breeze, and we had some air flow, just like my hair. But as you can see, it's, it didn't really work that great. Can you hear Kyle? Can you hear Kyle? Today is Sunday, I wonder if the Bills won. My landlord said he was gonna go watch the Bills game. But now I gotta move the rest of my stuff back inside. Now all the parts for this engine have come in anyways, so I can't completely do it. The, the supercharger probably will take the longest, but this is making progress, the Duramax is making progress, just everything's making progress. I hope you guys are making progress. I wanna give another reminder, I will be at Cecil County Dragway on October 28th. I believe the gates open at 10 a.m. I will be dragging the Duramax. I will have my brother Cole there. We will be selling merch. The Brat Board will be there. We'll have a machine tent. We'll probably have some tunes going. It's gonna be a really, really good time. I hope to see you there. I'm driving, I think, six and a half or seven hours to get there. So if you are driving any less time than that or more time than that, please come out. Meet your favorite machine freak, your favorite machine. I'd love to meet everybody. Uh, come out, it's gonna be a blast. There's gonna be a lot, a lot of people. I hope if today isn't going the best, I took you out of it for just a second and changed your pace. Stay good, stay fly, move like a well-oiled machine. Until next time, 3D Machines out.
Today's shout out goes out to Vin Marino. He put a Team 3D Machines decal on his Kawasaki. It's looking good, Vin.